aromatherapy for essential oils did you know eucalyptus therapeutic uses it can be used for antibacterial asthma arthritis chicken pox cough decongestant fever insect repellent measles migraine muscle pain rheumatism shingles sinusitis sprains throat infection essential eucalyptus oil applications are for arthritis muscle pain and rheumatism mix two to three drops in one ounce of carrier oil and massage on affected area for asthma coughs sinus sinusitis stuffed up nose and throat infections use five to seven drops in a vaporizer can also be mixed in a carrier oil and massage massaged on the chest to kill airborne bacteria in a sick room, use in a spray bottle. Mix 10 drops of eucalyptus oil in one quart of water. Shake well before spraying. To guard against fly infestation, put eucalyptus oil droplets of put eucalyptus oil droplets on a ribbon and hang near window or place on window sills. Refresh weekly. Eucalyptus oil for chicken pox and shingles. Use two to three drops on a cotton swab and apply to affected areas. Relief pain associated with these ailments. As an insect repellent, mix eucalyptus oil equal amounts with bergamot and lavender. If applying to skin, use in a carrier oil. If using in a linen closet, apply cotton ball and place on shelves. This is all about eucalyptus oil. To freshen up, to freshen up garbage beans, place a few drops of oil on a paper towel and wipe over lid or place in the bottom of the bin to both kill germs and smell. Eucalyptus oil safety information. Avoid during pregnancy. Do not use if diagnosed with high blood pressure or epilepsy. Always use in dilution. Avoid if taking homeopathic remedies as eucalyptus act as an antidote against such therapies. I use eucalyptus in a humidifier. Comment below and tell me how you use eucalyptus oil. Thanks again for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, and hit the notification bell. So when the next video is out, you'll be notified. Again, this is simply you and I'm saying good night. Bye for now.